It's Project Central around here. With just a little imagination, some of this, a bit of that, the possibilities are endless. Whether you're just getting started or you know your way around a glue gun, we have the supplies and ideas to help get it done. Say YES to DIY at HSN. Who knew a little piece of plastic could be so much fun? Now, when you apply for the HSN card, instantly get $10 off. It's all about you. Extra flex on the things you love. Now, when you use your HSN card, you get extra flex all day, every day on all jewelry, beauty, and fashion purchases. Plus, no interest VIP financing, VIP easy returns, exclusive offers, all with no annual fee. Apply now. Call 1-800-695-1418 or search HSN card at hsn.com. Welcome to HSN. I'm Suzanne Runyon. This hour is all about really clever ideas for you and around your home. Um, I know we're wrapping up the day, so if you're on the line for any of the great NFL gear we have, please go to hsn.com and get in before midnight so you can really maximize all the savings. But in this hour, we're going to solve a lot of solutions, and this one's actually going to save you money in the long run. How many times you get out some uh, foil and you're just trying to wrap something and you rip it and you scrape your knuckles on it and it's just kind of a hot mess? Well, we have the Wrap Master back. We are down to only two colors and it is a set of two and it's designed to save you money because it's going to help wrap your food in a much easier way and joining me is big rapper himself john hi john the, the, the rapper the big rapper oh okay i'm calling you big rapper <laughs> how easy is that <laughs> <laughs> we can wrap just about anything with the wrap master it's very simple to do all you do is wrap it you snap it and the job's done see here's the problem we've all got these things at home right yeah you, you go to the grocery store you get that cardboard box with the roll of wrap inside the plastic wrap inside it's got that razor blade on the box that you cut yourself with when you open it to begin with mm -hmm. and and then you try and get that to tear right, and what happens? You tear the box. <laughs> it ends up in your drawers, so, you know, it's smashed up state like that. So here's what we want you to do. Get your wrap from the store, whether it's a national brand, a store brand, it doesn't matter. Take it out of the box and throw the box away. Then you put this in the wrap master. Now, once it's in the wrap master, you have complete control. The lid snaps shut, so it stays right out in your countertop or tabletop, or it fits right inside of any standard, standard size drawer. But look, up underneath here, there's two tabs that allow you to get a hold of that plastic wrap without having to struggle. If you've ever tried to uh, unwrap a, a roll of plastic wrap out of one of the cardboard boxes, you know what I'm talking about. Look, I'm going to lay the sandwich right here on top. We got a PB&J here. We're going to wrap up for the kids to take to school. All you do is wrap it. You snap the lid. It cuts it off perfectly, and you get a perfectly wrapped sandwich just like a deli would do it. And I mean, all you do is pull out what you need. There's no waste. There's no fuss. There's no muss. The kids can wrap their own sandwiches, and instead of using those bags with the zippers on them, now you've got a perfectly wrapped sandwich. The the, uh, the plastic wrap actually works like it's supposed to because it's you're in complete control like this. So whether you're doing uh, PB and J's or maybe you want to do a quick sub uh, to take to work with you, all you do is you wrap it, you snap it, and the job's done. I mean, how much simpler could it get? I know. Right? And it's one of those things you kind of go, I wish I would have thought. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, it just do, makes sense. You end up wasting so much foil. You waste so much plastic wrap. You know, plastic wrap is a smart idea. Yes. It's just not a smart thing to be able to use. And it's know? inexpensive, too. Right, right. But, and that's, the, the, that's why everybody loves it, because, I mean, who wants to take, let's say, for example, you want to wrap up a bunch of sandwiches. I mean, why would you take a plastic bag with a zipper on it right. that they say, and I noticed on the box the other day in the store I was looking at them, it, right on the box it says, reusable zipper bags. <laughs> Like, right? you never Who reuse reuses them? one of those plastic bags? Well, like you're doing now, your kids' lunch. <laughs> yeah. I mean, have those little plastic bags you go through right. just trying to wrap up all the all the lunch food. And it's not just for sandwiches. I mean, you can, we just, look at this. We just wrapped up all of these sandwiches in a matter of seconds. I mean, how long would that take you if you were struggling with that box with the razor blade on it This, you know, that's supposed to cut the, the stuff off? Right. But watch the, how quick and easy this is because when you've got leftovers, all right, you want to wrap up uh, the leftover beans. Place it in front of the wrap mask. You're in complete control. You don't waste anything. You wrap it. You snap it. And look at this. You get a drum-tight, airtight, listen to that, a drum-tight seal 
each and every time. And you don't have to worry about stuff spilling out of there because the wrap is doing the job it's supposed to do. It's supposed to cling to whatever bowl or whatever container that you're wrapping. And it doesn't matter with Wrapmaster. We just came out of a huge NFL thing here. Look at this. Even if your bowl's from, uh, you know, maybe it's a dish that uh, is at a tailgate party or maybe you're having a, you know, the, maybe you're having the, the guys over for the game. Now you can wrap it, you snap it, the job's done that quick and easy. I mean, right. <laughs> leftover coleslaw back into the fridge. Why do you want to take leftovers off of one bowl, off of one plate or bowl, and then put them into another one right. and then dig around for a lid, you know, those plastic lids that you can never find and never match? <laughs> well, look, place it in front of the wrap master. It doesn't matter if you need six inches of plastic wrap or if you need six feet. Now you can do it quick and easy. You can wrap an entire, you know, like, three foot long sub if you want right. to, and it's done quick and easy with the wrap master. How, and again, how thick of a roll can you put in? Well, it, it, the, and it, standard size rolls, whatever roll that you normally get in the, in the grocery store. Okay. The standard size rolls up to 250 square feet, oh, wow. whether it be a, a store brand, national brand, whatever it is, you take it out of the box, you throw the box away because these things are useless anyway. What is and the then, most common comment that people say that it made it a customer pick? Why? That, it's because it's so simple to use. Once you use it the first time, you'll understand why it's become like, uh, like, Crazy. Uh, yeah, there's like a cult just, following <laughs> on this. It's so simple because, and I keep mine right out on the countertop, okay? Yeah. I keep it right next to the back, nice. back, back to the backsplash. I've got mine in red, but uh, yeah, you know, you can get them in white, red. Look at this though, you get a perfect wrap each and every time. Look at that. It's perfect, and it's always there when you need it. Right. So instead of digging through a drawer to find a, uh, I'll tell you what, maybe, maybe it's that half oh, a melon, yeah, do okay? This one. That uh, that you, you know you never eat a whole melon, so right. you always put the half and back really, in the fridge. You know that doesn't really fit in a zippy bag. <laughs> yeah, right. You know. Now you can pull out the wrap. Look at this. I'm placing it way out here on the table. I'm just going to set the melon on top. You wrap it, you roll it, you oh. snap it, and the job's done. That quick and easy. You get a perfectly wrapped metal, melon ready to go in the fridge. Now it's not going to dry out. Now it's going to be just as fresh as when you cut it in half. Okay, so, um, let's explain because I don't want the yeah. colors to sell out. Um, you get a second one. Why the second yes. one? Yes, well the second one is for the tin foil, and I've got that over here because and you I get one for your, your plastic wrap, one for tin foil. <laughs> good one. And by the way, these come loaded, right? Am I right? They, they come with a roll of, of, of plastic oh. wrap in it oh, and you get, you get a, a roll. Set. You get a starter set. I did and not. A, yes, you do. Yeah. You do. <laughs> so here's how easy this is to load though. So when you run out of the plastic wrap or the tin foil, that it comes with, yep. you go to the store, you buy up to 207, or 250 square foot rolls, and whether they're plastic wrap or tin foil, open it up just like this. There's two tabs on either side. You pull the rack out. Now I'm gonna slide this off of the stem here. By the way, it comes with instructions too, so it's pretty simple. Now, all you do is you slide this inside. It comes with two different sizes, okay? So this little thing here fits inside this, the, the roll, okay? That, that little cardboard mm -hmm. roll. If you have the larger ones, we, it, we also include the one for the larger ones, but oh, these are great. all universal, so it doesn't matter. See how these flex? It'll fit in any size roll, so it doesn't matter whether it's a national brand, store brand. You put the cap back on. Now I'm going to slide this back inside. I'm going to pull out a little bit. You snap there. You you uh, lock. You put the cartridge back in there. Now you can pull out a little bit. You can pull out a lot, but all you do is snap the lid. Now here's the secret. Okay, the secret is in the cutting blades, and I want you to notice here. I'm running my hand along this cutting blade, and it's not cutting me. All right, but I want, I'm gonna, it's spring loaded. Can you see that? Now that one's specifically designed for tin foil. The other one is specifically designed for the plastic wrap. But when you pull out what you need, whether you need six feet or six inches, or maybe you need a half an inch of tin foil, all you do is press down on the lid and you get a perfect precise That's cut awesome. each and every time. Okay, you get two, and yes, you do get 50 square feet of foil and 50 square feet included. of plastic wrap <laughs> right? included. We're down to the white and the red set, and then that's it. And we're gonna say hi to Teresa in Alabama. Oh, great. Because she owns this. Hi, Teresa, welcome. You're on with John and Suzanne. Hello. Hi, Teresa. What do you think about this? I think they are wonderful. <laughs> <laughs> and why? Well, I received them about six weeks ago, uh -huh. and they work exactly as he is saying they work. Does it save they a lot are of time? Fantastic. It saves you a lot of time then? Yes, they do. And used to just the regular fall in the package it comes in. Yes. When it's in the drawer, 
if I reach into the drawer to get the foil, if the cutting part is like turned up, I have this... put my hands and my fingers on it. Oh yeah. So I've learned to turn the box with the cutting part facing down. Right. But now with this, I don't have to worry. No more cut. Right. Awesome. And no more wrestling with like plastic exactly, wrap. Exactly, with the plastic. <laughs> right, right. It's so always so frustrating. Crazy. Yeah, absolutely. So if somebody's watching, Teresa, obviously you sound happy with it. Would you say they should try this out? Oh, absolutely. Absolutely. Actually, when I ordered mine, they came with a set of three. Oh, okay. Oh, so lucky I'm you. I'm keeping two, and I'm giving one to my daughter for her plastic wrap. Oh, that's so very no nice. So no more struggling for her. Well, that's very generous of you. <laughs> Teresa, thank you for joining us and telling us your story. Thanks, well, Teresa. Well, I really do like mine. I ordered the red, and, and they fit right in my drawer, no problem. They're easy to load, yep. and I am just so glad I ordered them. They just Love make it. sense, right? Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, Teresa. It, well, it is. It's one of those aha things yeah. that you're watching now and you're going, maybe. Yeah. And There's then, a whole think, half a pizza. <laughs> but think about this, though. We all have the same problem. Yes. We all have had plastic wrap, and you're like, I'm just trying to get out the door. I'm going to a friend's barbecue, and I need to wrap this potato yep. salad. And it's all over the place, and it's a hot mess. And then you're trying to peel it apart right. to still use the plastic. Hey, listen. That all ends tonight. Wait, Keep John, this hang on. right out. Oh, yep. I got to give an update. Okay. Um, in the white, we're down to the final 300. So the White's going to sell out right now, and then I'll have the red left. And the red looks great, too. You have that at your house, right? Yep, that's what I have. Yeah, and I'll great. tell you, I keep mine right out on the countertop, okay? Uh, you can put it in a drawer because they lock. The lids lock right here on the front. Now, underneath here, there's four feet, okay? These are silicone feet that kind of keep it They keep it stable on the table. It almost locks it down. They're not suction cup, but it seems that way when right. you use it. Right. So it doesn't move. So when you pull out what you need, like, I keep one out right by the barbecue because I wrap up my potatoes. I do the corn. You saw me doing corn earlier, but what I do is I'll put a pad of, of butter in there with some salt and pepper and then wrap it and that's then you nice. throw it on the grill. It's oh, better that's that way. Perfect. And then, but I mean, even just for wrapping potatoes, I mean, even for in the oven, it's great this way because you can do it quick, safe, fast, and easy. And you're not wasting a bunch of tin foil. When you're cutting it, like when, when you're using a box like this, you pull out a little bit, then it tears sideways. You end up pulling more it's out. So I mean, when's the last time? How about this? Maybe you want to cover a cookie sheet. All right. Uh, you know, because you don't want them to get dirty. I mean, this is a brand new cookie sheet. It's beautiful. You want to keep it looking that way. So now you just place that in front of the wrap master. Instead of wrapping a half a foot underneath on each side, right. look at this. You get a perfect fit each and every time because you're in control. You cut it the, way, the, the, the desired length that you want it. Right. But let's go back over here to the plastic because I tell you what, with this plastic wrap, again, you can go through, I mean, you can wrap tons of sandwiches with this. All you do well, is wrap you know it, you snap funny. it. I think this is even more relevant because it's back to school. Yes. I mean, how, you, how many of you are packing lunches for the kids? Right. And you, you know, even trying to open up a zippy thing and stick <laughs> know. a sandwich into a zippy thing is actually kind of awkward. And you end up crushing the sandwich as you're shoving it uh -huh. in. Because you know you've cut the sandwich in half for the kids, <laughs> right. of course, right? So if you're doing all the back to school, moms, you're going to be so happy. If you are just saying, hey, you know what? I want to save leftovers and, and get them sealed rather nicely. This is perfect for that. If you've got the gang, or if you're all going to get together, and you're taking a bunch of food to someone's house. Yep. It's so perfect for all those things. And you'll never have to wrestle with plastic anymore, and you'll never have to wrestle with foil anymore. I know. And in the long run, you actually save a lot of time and you save money. I really, mean, look at think that. About it. How long would that take you if you were doing that with, a, with oh, please, the, you know, with the cardboard please. box? And you know you get it wrong, <laughs> and you're like, oh, it's over and yeah, over again. Who wants to take the leftovers right. from one container and put it in another? Right, all you exactly. do is you wrap it, you snap it, you get a perfect airtight, drum-tight seal on any container. I mean, Look at that. Isn't that That's awesome? drum tight. <laughs> All right, Mr. Drum, we're going to wrap it up. The white oh. will be gone, so stay in the line for the white. You jump uh, jump uh, onto the red if you miss out on the white and it's sold out. But, John, you are not leaving me nope, very, I am very, not. very soon because we have something else got to show you. have another clever idea for you tonight. Uh, yeah, so you're going to find out what it is in just a second. Okay, so I'm going to show you something else. And I think with everything that's going on um, down in Texas and all of our thoughts really go out to all the folks in Texas um, who are suffering from Hurricane Harvey. And unfortunately, there's another hurricane that's kind of heading sort of toward us. They don't know exactly where it's gonna go yet. I just saw the most recent report, but here's what I really have learned. You gotta be ready because you never know what's gonna happen. I personally have a dear friend, Heather, her parents, the Pritchards, her kids, um, they were dramatically affected by Texas. And everybody thinks, oh, it's never gonna happen to me. And to actually have someone 
who you're very, very much care about and know they're in such distress and, and understanding that maybe they weren't prepared, that's a horrible feeling. It's horrible for those of us who are away, but imagine if you're involved in it. And you really don't think it's ever gonna happen until it happens. And then you're like, oh my gosh, wasn't I, why, why, why wasn't I ready? Well, one thing that they will say, no doubt about it is, you've gotta have food because it's even worse if you don't have food. And you've seen the stories, right? Where people didn't have food, they didn't have water, they didn't have the essentials. And tonight we're offering ahead of time a pre-sell of our wise food collection. Why is this so vital? Because it's going to get you prepared for whatever. I have wise at home. I've sent it to my husband or my son at college just to eat because he was eating dumb food all the time. And what you're getting, I did. I sent him a box and I said, stop eating the junk. Eat the wise. And literally he was fed for a month on it. Um, $89.95. This is actually a pre-sale of what's going to be a today's special. And we're launching that tonight at midnight, right? Oh, I'm sorry, it's the bed tonight. When are we launching this one specifically? Oh, on the 6th. So you are able to get this right now. And what it is, it's supply of 32 total servings for $89.95. We have free shipping. So the deal we're going to offer on the 6th, we're actually giving you a head start on it. And honestly, if you think you're not going to be the one, it's never going to happen to you, and that it happens, you'll just go, oh my gosh, why wasn't I ready? And everyone advises that you have something like this at home. Be prepared. So easy. And it's available right now. Okay, so we're going to continue on because John's got some more magic for us. John, what are you doing over there? I'm slicing and dicing and chopping, and I, we got the clever cutter. We love the I mean, clever cutter. <laughs> I know, it just makes sense. I'll tell you what, this will save you so much time and so much hassle in the kitchen, uh, just for doing all of your slicing and dicing. If you can use a pair of scissors, you can use a clever cutter. <laughs> and I mean, basically, what it does is it, it, it makes anybody into a chef, because chefs have to go through years of culinary school to learn how to use a knife. Now, with the clever cutter, what we've done is we put a knife and a cutting board all in one piece. And here at HSN, I want you probably saw this on TV. This item has gone viral worldwide. I mean, it's everywhere, and everybody's talking about it. But only here at HSN, we give you the deluxe model. Right there on the blade, it says, it says uh, stainless Germany, all right? That, yeah, the, you get the upgraded German stainless steel blade with this. And, and you get a set of two. And you get a set and of two. And you get a peeler. That's right. And you get the Clever Cutter Caddies. And, I mean, it's such a great set. I mean, anybody that does any amount of cooking will love this. It, what it does, it's got a dual hinge design. You see how when I squeeze this together, it takes no effort at all. I'm using basically two fingers and a thumb here to squeeze it together. It's a spring-loaded design, but it also locks closed. There's a lock in the back that keeps it closed, so you can put this in the dishwasher. The blade's always protected in your drawer. Or I'll, or I'll tell you what, here, with this too, with this dual hinge design, it allows you to slice with effortlessly, okay? I mean, whatever it is that you want to slice, dice or chop it takes the effort out of it. So if you if you know somebody, or maybe you yourself have dexterity problems, that, you know maybe it's arthritic fingers or whatever it is that you have a hard time using a knife in the kitchen. Now with the clever cutter, whether you're slicing way back here by the handle or right out there at the tip, you have complete control because your cutting board and your knife are all in one. Look how much you <laughs> cut up in I, a couple seconds. I know, and I got to show you this because it's the power that that dual hinge design allows you. That allows you. It allows you to do things that you normally can't do with a knife like oh, I can just slice right through crazy. this avocado pit wow. and all wow. I, I mean it gives you that power but even for things like making salads in a bowl maybe you want to do a quick chopped salad now you can do that because of that cl the clever cutter design allows you to do things like again I always like to say if you can use a pair of scissors you can use a clever cutter it cuts everything but but bad habits and taxes I mean <laughs> you'll slice every vegetable in the in the crisper in the fridge now, that's I mean, amazing too because celery you have to do stock for stock for stock. Right. And this you can just knock you it out You can grab really the quick. whole bunch if you like. Yeah. Instead of taking the stalks apart like that, right. right? Now you can, I mean, you can do one stalk at a time if you like, uh, you know, into it. The nice thing about this too is it's not like a knife, all right? When you're using a knife, what happens? Here's a regular knife and a cutting board over here. And just to give you an example, okay? Knives, they hit the countertops. They hit your counter, your cutting board. They hit your plates and dishes and your knives eventually go dull. And with a knife, you don't have the control because your handle's way back here on the 
the end so it can go this way, that way. And I mean, if you have a hard time using a knife, with, and even if your knives are, <laughs> they're probably so dull. You, dull. <laughs> yeah, well, that's the nice thing about the Clever Cutter because it's razor sharp and it stays sharp because that cutting board is designed for the Clever Cutter knife. So you don't have to worry about it going dull after a while. You can sharpen the knife like a, you, like a regular knife, but I mean, the oh, amount see, of slicing nice. and dicing, the speed that you can go through things. And the other thing too, when you're cutting on a cutting board, I mean, why would you want to dice up or slice up a bunch of carrots like this and then have to pick them up off the cutting board and then put them in your salad bowl and then you know, you're just, dirtying just up yeah you're stuff, just making right? a bigger mess right. with the clever cutter it cuts just about everything but everything goes where you want it so if you want to slice uh, you know lemons or limes into a bowl or if you want to do apples for an apple salad or maybe you want to uh, slice apples for an apple pie everything goes into the container where you want them okay I like to say I like to do this too I, we've got a soup pot over here uh, I mean if you want to slice right into a soup pot like let's say for example you want to do a bunch of, of celery you can take two or three stalks of celery and as you're slicing everything goes right into your frying pan your soup pot and you can get as precise as you like if you want really thin slices you can do really thin slices if you want to just zip through it and you don't really care if they're big or small or in between you can power through it and again it gives you the power to do things that you normally can't do with a knife I mean if you want to that's take crazy, cobs yeah. of corn and cut them into that's, thirds that's impressive that's yeah. that dual hinge design. Wait, and again, you know what's really funny? You ever try to cut an ear of corn? Yeah. I mean, it's really hard to cut an <laughs> it's ear not of corn. That, it's not that it easy like to black. do, right? You know what I really like is this, when you talk about herbs? Yes. Because a lot of times you want to get those herbs consistent and you want them uh -huh. very, very small in a recipe. And how I about, love that. How the about leeks, leeks like yeah. this? I mean, right. all you do is make a couple of slices and now you can mince or dice your leeks right into a soup pot or right into a salad. And again, it gives you the power, but you don't have to worry. Hey, you don't have to worry about the size, the shape, whatever it is, because you can do just about everything with the Clever Cutter. Like I said, you, you can kind of see why this has gone viral. I mean, yeah. it, people love it because of the versatility and because of the speed that you can get things done. Plus, it gives you that power that you normally can't do. You know, you can't do this kind of work with a regular knife. And that's that German stainless steel blade. Because it's attached to its own cutting board, now you can do, like I said, if you can use a pair of scissors, you can use the Clever Cutter. And here, take a look at this. Even for things like bread, I mean, you can slice just about everything with this for your baguettes. I, I mean, it does just about everything. You mentioned That's herbs brilliant. earlier. Yeah. How about for slicing herbs or for chopping herbs? Instead of doing this, uh, you know, where you have to chop it or drag out a food processor to do this, now you can do this right on your uh, cutting board or countertop or right into a you salad. You know what I like too? I love salad sliced thin. Right. Is that weird? Do you <laughs> kind of like that? Oh yeah. I don't like big chunky pieces of salad. Right. So, you know, if you're like me, like you could have a head of lettuce because you know it's less expensive to buy it when it's the head and you can get that perfect kind of thin sliced salad. They serve at a local restaurant here and I crave that size of lettuce. <laughs> right. It's weird, but it's true. <laughs> well, because we, again, because of that clever cutter design, it gives you the power for doing things like pan fries or home That's fries. Crazy. But if you don't want them uh, like, you know, potato chips like this, you can also do things, slice them this way first, and now you can do your half slices for your pan fries or home fries. Instead of for scalloped potatoes or homemade right. potato chips, you right. can also slice them in half like that first. But you can even do your finer things like here, we'll go back here to this uh, little salad bowl for radishes, onions, garlic, all of those small things. It allows you to do that because you're in complete control. Mushrooms like this, maybe you want to saute some mushrooms for a steak dinner or for adding to a, an omelet in the morning. It easily goes through there. And, and again, if you can use a pair of scissors, you can use the clever cutter because it takes it takes the power. It does. It, it has the power to so do the cutting to that you don't have to. Right. <laughs> right well, exactly. And also, I mean, think about um, how you normally prep a meal. I think a lot of times when we go to cook, we don't eat certain recipes because there's too much prep work. That's there's right. There's too much cutting. There's too much. You have to be like an expert knife uh, handler. <laughs> right. Um, I think with this in your kitchen, you'll find you'll try more recipes. You'll be willing to have a healthier meal yes. because the prep on making a salad is now a breeze. That's right. Yeah. So it you'll cuts find the your prep eating time down. Change. Yeah, dramatically. It's, it's right? like having your own little, I don't know, a little sous chef in yeah. the kitchen because it does all the work. Again, all you do is squeeze the handle. It does the work. And again, it doesn't take much to squeeze this handle. You can see I'm powering through these carrots. I'm doing, look at this. Another, here's another avocado and I'm going to do this right through the pit. It cuts everything That's right crazy. through the pit because That's of impressive. that dual hinge design. Now, how about this? How about for your uh, cheese? Okay. You ever try and slice cheese with a regular knife on a cutting board where you get one side thick, one side thin. Right. Now you have complete control and you you can slice your cheese perfectly. If you want a super thin slice, you can go thin. If you want it thicker, you can go thicker. How about your cooked meats? Maybe it's a fajita
tonight and you want to slice your cooked chicken, now you can slice your cooked chicken for your fajitas. And again, how about, or maybe it's a steak fajita. I mean, with the Clever Cutter, like I said, you, it, it cuts everything but bad habits and taxes. I mean, you can cut a cow in half, all right, and that's no bull. <laughs> and I wouldn't steer you wrong. Okay, Here, John's going to be performing the Love Holiday <laughs> next Sunday. Make sure to tip the waiters. Let's say hi to Sharon in California. I think I might have been milking it a little there, sorry. <laughs> Oh, he's got a million of them. Hey, Sharon, thanks for joining us. Welcome to HSN. Thank you. I uh, I called in I because I actually own one of these. Oh, good. And it has, I mean, I'm not even kidding. I am the worst cook. I have absolutely no ability <laughs> in the kitchen whatsoever. And I, because I have this, I now buy my vegetables and make salads with it because okay. it's so easy and it makes it fun and it's, you know, it's just effortless. Yeah. And so I can just like chop, 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 and uh, everything comes out great. And I just want, now I'm watching you, seeing all kinds of uses for it that I never would have thought of, like potatoes. Uh huh. Yeah, but it's great. And I bought two sets so I could use them as gifts. Oh, good, good. Oh, that, and, and again, you know, just to your point, Sharon, everybody gets two. So yeah. you can keep one and you can give the other one away. Oh, it's yeah. Actually a and they're a too. great gift. What a great stocking I, stuff. I love this thing. It's, it's, greatest thing since light bread. Yeah. Well, and how nice. Now you are exactly what I said. You're eating healthier because now yeah. the prep's not so much effort. Right. Exactly. I always used to buy salad bar salad, and mm. now I don't. I just buy the vegetables and I use this. That's smart. Okay. And you know what? I, I imagine you're saving a ton of money because you're not being, you're not buying the pre-prepared stuff. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. perfect. Well, good. Well, Sharon, thanks for chatting with us. Oh, my pleasure. I'm excited to be getting more of these. Oh, good, good. Good, good, good. Them. Well, and I will tell you, thanks, Sharon. We've now sold over 3,200. We've sold a lot. <laughs> and let me just reiterate what you're getting. Yes. I think, you know, yes. John's good at choppy, choppy, oh, and choppy. I got to show you this, too. And lots of jokey, jokey, jokies. But yeah. let me show you. Hold, hold, one second. <laughs> go, go for it. Go, go, go. <laughs> You're getting a set of two. You can't even see this back one. It's actually hidden, so I'm yeah. kind of trying to pull it out here. You get two of these, and this is the deluxe, by the way. It's not the infomercial one. You get a better version. This is actually the holder, so yep. when you're not using it, if you want to attach it, you can actually slide it in yep. here like exactly. that, and it holds it for you. And and that mounts right on the inside of a cabinet cool. door. It's yeah, got so a little, little peel and stick thing on the back. the back. You pull that off. Put and it you, in. Yep. Bloop, and it stores perfectly. It's a and now <gasps> you get the peeler. Yeah, and I, I got to show you this. Peeler. This peeler, I'm, I'm looking at this flex bay that we get today. I mean, yeah, you would yeah, spend. Four, oh yeah, four dollars I mean, and ninety nine. Yeah, right. I mean. This peeler is worth like two flex bait, more than that. And you're getting it free with it. Look, it peels going forward, it peels going back. It's twice as fast as any other peeler that you've ever used because it works both directions. But it's such a cool peeler because you can do all kinds. It's a stainless steel blade that does amazing work on your vegetables. You have be peeling your apples, carrots, kiwi fruit, zucchini. But even with carrots like this, you can make these carrot ribbons. I mean, you can't do that with a normal peeler. But look at this, you can wrap this up, roll it up. Now you can make little garnishes for a roast ham or lamb in the oven. Or maybe you want to do a little roll like this, stick a toothpick through it for your, your, uh, for your uh, uh, vegetables, for like a, a salad, to garnish a salad, or for stir fries. But I mean, and you get that peeler with it. Now, I always, I always get asked about this little tab right here. What that tab is for, if you get to an eye in your potato, as you're peeling through your, your potatoes, you get to an eye. Instead of peeling it down, you can use that eye to dig that, or that oh, little hello. tab to dig the eye out of your <laughs> potato. Isn't so that uh, yeah, I mean, And it's a great little peeler. Keep it right in your knife drawer. You'll use it every single day. Okay, so <laughs> I would, I'll, honestly, Honestly, think gift giving, think multiples, and the four flex pay is only good for this weekend. I think that's an all because it's funny when you brought it up. Right. John and I have talked about this product a lot, and we've never had four flex. I know. So I know, the it's four dollars and ninety nine cents to save money in the kitchen, to yeah. eat healthier, to prep quicker. Like, look at how fast I this know. is. It's really And to give you the power it. that you need to do those cuts that yeah. you know you normally can't I do with a regular knife. I thought going the corn knife. was pretty darn I mean, yeah, the I mean, it does just about right. everything. All right. So here we go. Uh, now thirty six hundred have been ordered. Please stand the line for it. Just a quick update. If you're getting the Wrap Master, the white is almost gone. We have 90 left in the double set of white. You get two, one for your foil, one for your plastics, and it is almost sold out in white. John, thanks for hanging oh, out. Thank you. All right. That's now I'm going to really let you go. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. We've got more to show you, so stay right there. In fact, oh, coming up. This is pretty awesome. You might have seen it on the infomercial, and we're so excited to have all three links back. Now, my producer, and I'm actually quoting my producer, he said, his name is Daryl, it does everything 
we say it does and it doesn't stick to roots or on bushes. So if you're trying to drag a hose around your house and it gets stuck on everything, it's not gonna happen. If you want something that's nearly indestructible, I mean, you can stomp on it, you can almost drive a car over it and it will not flatten out, this is the hose for you. It's very, very lightweight. That was what really surprised me for how really ridiculously durable it is. It's crazy lightweight and that will be coming up. It's our bionic steel hoses. All right, if you'd like to save a couple of dollars, well, you know what, here's what's interesting. We always talk about saving $10, you apply, if you're approved, that's great, you save $10 on whatever you're shopping for. And you know, when it comes to some of our items, it means it could virtually be free, right? But what I really love is you get special deals that no one else gets if you have our HSN card. And that's things many times we never even talk about on the air. So if you've never applied for it, you can do it online. And if you're approved, yes, you get $10 off, which is a nice little savings, but it's what happens beyond that that'll really surprise you. All right, we gotta move on. And now we're gonna go to the world of origami. Now, what's origami? Well, quite frankly, almost everything we've ever offered in origami has quickly become a customer pick because it's smart storage solutions. And of course, we wouldn't have a Labor Day event without having some origami on it. And joining me is Miss Tracy Rose. Hi, Trace. Hi, my friend. How are you? I am so excited to have these little guys back. I know, right? We haven't had them back in a long time, No, actually. no. It's been, I think, since June, maybe. Yeah, yeah. So, you know the history behind this. Let me share it really quickly. When we first started with this item, it was one, and it was silver you know and it just came in a one pack and then it became such a huge customer pick and we started to read the reviews and we heard from you and he said I'd love it there was a nice wood top to it and more colors so boom origami did that and we've given you this nice wood top and then we've given it to you in a variety of colors as well this is, and wait we've doubled it and we doubled it it's a two <laughs> yeah, pack yeah. <laughs> yeah so that we, we doubled the fun basically with this so this is what we love about this organizer first and foremost it sits on top of your counters second it's three drawers of storage look at the amount of space that you're going to get with each one of these drawers you've got the wood handles the powder coated steel you've got that extra wood chopper board on top. I love it for the countertops, but what I really like this for is in those cabinets mm -hmm. underneath the sink because all of this right here, look at all that Perfect. space that normally goes unused. You can have your cleaners right there. You can have your sponges, your microfiber cloths, all of that, and it just sits on the wood. Look at it in the office. It's that perfect size. It's 13 by 10 inches, so you can fit the big papers in there, That's coupons. You can put all of your receipts, pens, <gasps> pencils. Make it your electronic charging station. Oh my gosh. Oh, put all those cords? Yes. Oh, I how couldn't use my camera be? this summer because I still can't find the silly cord. <laughs> I'm mad about it. I'm bitter well, about it. Well, you know, seriously, you have the cord yeah. store here and you put all your phones and everything on top yes. and they're charging. So this would be yeah. the greatest charging station on the face of the earth. Which is great because I got kids and they have to have a charge. They can't take it in their rooms at night. They got to charge their phones and stuff here. But you're right. exactly right. But you're getting two. So one's a charging station, one's for the office, one's for the bathroom, one's for the kitchen, one's for the pantry ones for the kids room I mean there there's right. so many different possibilities why is the powder coated steel important let me tell you if you're putting it underneath your cabinets in your kitchen most of this stuff is wet let's be honest you know there's your sponges are wet your scrubbies are wet and you would be nervous to put this on particle board or any other type of material but because it's aerated because it's that powder coated steel it's not going to rust or chip let me give you the dimensions we've got 10 inches wide right here 13 inches inches tall and then 13 inches deep right here so it's that great footprint that's not going to take up too much space but it's going to give you enough storage space for all of your storage needs you know i think it's interesting too is this middle rack has a a, a more depth yep and that's so clever and smart mm -hmm. too so it might be thinner things Look you have this. here in the bottom mm -hmm. but you have more depth here yeah all right what are the colors exactly well i'm going to give you a quick update the silver i have 170 left in this silver set so that's almost sold out that should actually sell out in this set hour. Then in the red, I've got about 800 left in the red set. I love the red. That's mm -hmm. one of the new colors. And then of course we have the bronze. This is always really popular. We bring in more bronze than any other colors basically. So there's your bronze and I've got about 800 there. And then the white, white is always the number one bestseller because it's very kitchen friendly. We have about 900. And that's funny because that's uh, across the board. There's only really a couple hundred left in everything. Right, right. Very limited. And just so you'll know, it is the first time you're seeing it this weekend and we have a special holiday weekend flex of 
four flex payments of $17.49. That's crazy. Yeah, that's that's awesome. That's awesome. So I love that you did mention that, Suzanne, because think of all your Andrew Lesman supplements or your vitamins or anything like that. Think of your spice racks. We know that, you know, some spices are taller and, and smaller than others. But as you said, there's the smaller bottles can go up here. The taller ones, there's enough space here. The flatter boxes can go nicely into this area. But now everything is at your fingertips. This can be your medicine cabinet. And then this right here can go in your bathroom and it can be your makeup. It can be all of your um, eye stuff up here, your nail polish down here, your lip stuff down here, your lotions, your potions, whatever you need it to be. And then this top area can be like a little dressing area. You can have your mirror on top or your jewelry or whatever you're using to get ready at that moment. It's wood and steel. It's that beautiful quality of origami. Zero assembly. It comes just like this. You don't even have to put the drawers in. You don't have to do anything. You just take it out of the box and it's absolutely ready to go. But you're getting two. And I just love that feature. Each one of my girls has one because they come home with so much stuff from school now. So much stuff that I've got to sign, that they've got to stay organized in. Stuff even that, you know, stuff that's due next week or in a month. This gets everybody organized. It helps me with my business expenses. I can put those receipts here. Bills that are due next week can go here. Bills that are due in a month can go in another drawer. But it's now that wonderful organization system that we all crave. Well, something else, Trace, I think it's so important yeah. to understand. We all look for this kind of stuff. And then we go to our local supermarket. Mm -hmm. And what do they have? These little creepy plastic tabletop drawer things. Right. And you get it at home and the drawers always jam. Right. They never close straight and they're always wobbly. You can just tell. I mean, you're frustrated. You, mm -hmm. you know in your heart of hearts you just wasted your good hard-earned money. Or you spend a little bit more. Because I know you're like, wow, so, you know, what is it? $69.95. That's, you know, that's not chump change, right? But go ahead and do that because you're using these for years. Yep. And you will have none of the frustrations. And if you don't believe me, you just read what the reviews have to say. This is a huge customer pick. At, you know, and, and that's incredible for something you're like, wait, it's a tabletop. So if you try to get all organized, maybe it's your husband's hobby area outside. Maybe it's a whole bunch of little tools. Maybe you're a crafter like I am. Like these are a crafter's dream because we have all the stuff, you know? We have all our little stamps and we have all our little inks. Like for me, just to be an ink drawer and to hold a bunch of my stamps, this would be a brilliant thing. But once you buy it, this is something that's built so well, you're using it for years. So don't hesitate because you can buy a lot of those little creepy plastic things and they look bad and they're just gonna fall apart and they become frustrating. You ever put stuff in one of those plastic things and you never open it again? Yeah. Like years later, you go to your bathroom and go, what is in here? <laughs> and do you ever notice that it's like foggy plastic? So you never know, you can't see it's in true. there. You don't, you don't even know what's in there. Right. That's one of the things I love about this because I think we all can relate. We all have a junk drawer. We yeah. all have got a drawer that is just kind of our go-to place, but you forget what's in there. This allows you to see exactly, hey, my batteries are here. Or say it's time Christmas and the holidays are around the corner. I can, okay, when I go to wrap something, I can never find the tape and the scissors at the same time. So true. <laughs> so here I got my, my tape, my scissors, my tissue paper, my ribbons, whatever I need. Or if I'm doing holiday cards, you know, everything, the stamps Great are right idea. here. Everything is at my fingertips. But even great for the kids' room if you're teaching them how to get organized or for smaller toys. I also love the fact that these drawers don't come out. So, and they don't get top heavy. So if, there's a, if this is all loaded down and you can get five pounds of weight in each one of these, it's not wow. going to tip over. You know, it's designed perfectly like that. And then we've created that top shelf here to give you that extra workspace. So dimensions again, because I want you to think of underneath those cabinets. I want you to think of in the bathroom, in the kitchen. It stands 13 inches tall. It is 13 inches deep and it's 10 inches wide. So the footprint isn't crazy on this, right. you know? And think Yet of, it holds a lot. And it holds a lot. It's surprising. And, and again, think of all of that wasted space underneath the cabinets there. You know, you've got your your, your sponges, you've got your cleaners, you've got, um, you know, pods. Think of the laundry room. Think of all the coffee pods. I just Think have a bunch office. of cleaning rags. Yeah. You know, I'm just piled up underneath. Like, and the, what, the, they're the, not really organized at all. No, and if they're damp, I get nervous because we have wood cabinets. I don't like to put damp, uh, you know, sure. sponges on that. I always double buy in spices because I have one of those lazy Susans that go to the back of the cabinet mm -hmm. and it's totally disorganized. Right. But if I had something that was right at eye level, I could see exactly exactly what I needed and what I had and what I didn't have and all of that. I love it for fresh fruits. I love the fact that I can go to the store and I can load up on, on fresh fruits and fresh vegetables and I can put them in this. Because if I were to take all these fruits and put them in a big bowl, they would just mush. 
they were just fruit flies and it just you know they go they go bad faster because they're aerated because they're single line because they're not sitting on top of each other now it's going to stay fresher longer and i love how alice i mean how suzanne noticed the the different depth right here so it gives you an extra space to put some of your taller items here your smaller items here and just create that perfect storage solution with this and you're getting two yeah so you don't great. have to make a decision like oh i'll use uh, i need it for my kitchen we well, got one for your kitchen in the bathroom one for the office one for the craft room one for the kids room one for the office one for the garage one for the living room i mean you can use this anywhere that you need extra storage space and i love this i thought this was a clever mm -hmm. idea especially we were talking about packing kids lunches now oh, it's all yes. back to school this. i love this this is a little snack center mm -hmm. so if you're like hey make your kids pack their own lunch this is part of that yep. solution <laughs> which we do in our house you know and it's nice to teach them too about okay grab a little snack here and a little snack here and and when they come home from school but again you've got your snack station you've got your fruit ball you can fruit ball i got football in the mind <laughs> why because fruit of ball. my shirt i'm wearing <laughs> <laughs> and you've got all your medication now you've got you can put this in your bathroom because it's steel and wood it's not plastic it's not particle board it's going to do fine with the heat and the humidity it's wood and it's steel it doesn't get better quality with that and it's not coming in 50 different pieces you're not going to have to have three different drawers and screw in the racks and slide the drawers in or attach the wood attachment it comes in a box and you take it out and then that's it really, yeah. <laughs> that's really all there and is and you to really it. will see and feel the mm -hmm. quality even the wood on top you yeah. can tell that's solid yeah that's look not it. a particle board kind of thing no and if you get a tight shot of underneath you'll see that no two woods are exactly the same you get to see the different grains of wood in each one of these tops and that's when you can tell if you're getting the real world versus the particle board mm -hmm. and you can see across the board it's a beautiful like oak the handles match it perfectly Again, you're not gonna get that sound. You got the steel down here. And again, it's that additional powder coated steel so it won't rust, chip, or corrode. And we've got the color. So say you've got the red kitchen cart or the red pantry rack or the five drawer rack or something like that and you want it to be that same color, this will complement this. Yeah. The, the silver will complement it. The bronze will complement it. I, I get frustrated when I order from the same company and then a different shade comes. Oh, right. Because I do right. like, to, I like to be matchy matchy sometimes, right, you know? Right. So. I love the fact that Origami has coordinated all of those colors so you can get a complete organization system, you know? A couple things I just want to point out. In the silver, the silver, that is the most okay. limited. We're down to about 90 left. Wow. So the silver could sell out in this airing. You're saving $20 because you're shopping right now. Please note the 4Flex pay is only for this weekend. So on Monday night, it's going to become, or actually tomorrow night, the 4Flex won't even be an option at that point. It's a customer pick at the full price. So if someone's really happy at $89, think how happy you're going to be at what are you at 69.95 and that's wonderful and what i really like is you're saving money on shipping because these are fully assembled it's not like it's a teeny little earring box it's a really nice little savings because you're getting the free shipping but again that's for the holiday weekend that's not forever and ever and we don't do that very often understand origami is something you buy once and you use happily literally for years to come i can't tell you i have my original origami shelves i don't even know how old they are and they take a beating we use them we stack heavy stuff on them we use them all the time and they still are like almost completely brand new mm -hmm. i mean there's not a chip there's not a dent there's nothing wrong with them and i've had them now for several years right yeah and that's what we've all come to expect sure you can go out and get plastic drawers you can go out and get the, have you ever seen those new things that are like made of of, of um fabric they're cubes. Oh, yeah. Cubes made of fabric. Right. Okay. They have no stability whatsoever. No. Or those There's little no creepy. There's Well, and those plastic drawers, you start to fill them up and they get jammed mm -hmm. and the whole thing's wobbly and it's plastic and it doesn't really look good. No. These really, you, you will love to have out. And you can't put plastic in, in a lot of humid places. You can't put that in your bathroom. You couldn't, if you had something that was hot or something like that, you couldn't put that in plastic. You don't want to put, um, if you had wet, uh, wet sponges and you put that in plastic and you shut the door, yeah. that would, that, that is not, not good at all. But because this is aerated, because this is that powder coated steel, you can put all of your microfiber cloths right there at your fingertips. And then you've got two more drawers to put your sponges. But look at how it, it doesn't take up a huge footprint in the office. Your stamps, you've got your, your safety pins, you've got your tape, you've got, but you see big enough there for the paper, for the reams of paper that will fit in there. And a kids, in the kids room, you know, it's great for those tiny toys, their pencils, and their oh markers. 
gosh, when Ethan was small, he had more tiny toys than anything else. <laughs> it was know. insane. I know. Are your kids that one? Yes. <laughs> yeah, they are. It's like, and to keep track of it, you'd be like, where's the one little, uh, I don't right. know. <laughs> well, our big thing is just trying to teach the girls now to be more organized. So like when their project is due in a week, they're like, well, where is it? Where is it? Well, now you have an answer. You know, it's stuff right. that goes back to school tomorrow, right. stuff that's due in a week. See, that's and nice. I do it for me too. Right. Bills that are due when we have straight. Right? Well, somebody needs okay, to. Okay, so <laughs> don't forget the silver is almost completely sold out. The white's always the most popular. And I do personally love the bronze. Okay, I'm going to show you this. And this has been one of our most successful origami items that we've ever had. It is a huge customer pick. We've sold, oh, thousands yeah. and thousands and thousands. Can you give me like 15 seconds on 15 this? 15 seconds. 100% assembled, zero assembly required. It comes fully assembled, powder coated steel wood. We have all of the colors, Suzanne. We've got ye light yellow, red, silver, turquoise, blush. We've got tan. We've got the cutting board this time. We've got bronze and we've got white. Each one of those drawers holds 15 pounds worth of weight and That's you got right. that beautiful wood top. And you will love it, love mm -hmm. it, love it. Another customer pick, holiday weekend flex. So you only get five flex for this weekend. So if you wanted that, because we have a lot of people who have an origami wish list, you want to get it now. All right, here's our spotlight with Brett. I know Leslie's coming up to tell you what's happening at midnight, but I've got more, so stay tuned. Connecting you to your best life. Join me, Brett Chuckerman, for Connected Life Wednesday at 7 p.m. Our products help you relax, eat better, and feel empowered. Get ready for comfort and relaxation with a lounge doctor. Debbie Meyer's Genius Vac Countertop Vacuum Food Sealer helps prevent freezer burn to save money and skip the drive and take a ride on the Brookstone electric scooter. Join us Wednesday at 7 p.m. I'd worked for many, many years for one of the biggest beauty giants, and I really felt like the beauty industry had shut out women who were over 50. We decided to create a brand with passion behind it. Pride Beauty is absolutely cruelty-free. We have leaping bunny status. We give a dollar to animals out of every purchase. We have the very best from nature, cutting-edge ingredients, the best science. We're about real women, real results, real fast. Very good evening to you all. Starting our day off bright and early in just a couple of minutes, we will be offering you the best sleep of your life. From the iconic American brand Beauty Rest, this is their silver line, a plush, yummy, beautiful pillow top with the latest in technology, that silver technology that's gonna help keep your mattress fresher for longer. Of course, it's gonna help with the support, with the temperature management, giving you the most peaceful night's sleep you've ever had. Of course it is our today's special and it will be your final opportunity on a mattress today special from Beautyrest. So I hope you stick around with me. I've got tons of things I want to share with you. Lots of wonderful features and of course the price is just too good to pass up. So say goodbye to that old mattress. Replace it. Get the sleep of your life. Coming up in just a couple of minutes we'll toss to Suzanne and I'll see you in a couple of minutes. Well, thank you very much, and she'll tell you all the details in about 10, 15 minutes. Really quickly, if you notice my shirt and you're wondering, why am I wearing the Texans? It's because it's our Today Special, and that value of the two tees ends at midnight. So if you saw our NFL show or football fan shop, you want to get in now before we hit midnight because the deal is coming to a close. All right, so do you struggle with your hose? Do you hate your hose? Do you have those heavy green hoses, and you wish you could get rid of it? Well, we have the perfect solution, and Lou Caputo is back. Hello. To tell us about the... Bionic hose. It's bionic, it's, yes. It really is, though. It actually really kind of is. You know, it's funny, though, because I have so many people ask me about this hose now <laughs> since, we've been, since we've been doing it. Everyone like, wants to know. Is, like is for it real? Yeah. <laughs> is it really that good? You know what? It is that good, and I have two of these at my house. Now, let me show you just right off the bat why. First of all, the bionic hose is made with stainless steel, okay? And the only time you've probably seen a stainless steel hose before is on your washing machine. 
Oh, sure, yeah. Yeah, right, on yeah. the back. And the reason plumbers put it there is because they won't burst. And that's why the, you know, the Bionic Hose has got a huge plus to it. Because this will hold up to 600 PSI, pounds per square inch of pressure. Which, to put it in perspective, your house is putting out 60 at best. So They're it's kidding. like 10 times more than it needs. Yeah, the ends on this are rated at over 100 pounds pulling force. But here's the big deal. If I take the end of this and I squeeze it as hard as I can, which I am right now, okay? I take a rubber hose and put it right next to it. Look how easily I can kink that rubber hose. Like, this just think about off. it. Yeah, th there's no water coming through the rubber hose now. And that happens constantly. Right? Especially, and how frustrating is that when you got 100 feet of hose out and you got to backtrack it to find that, okay? Yeah. With, the, with the bionic hose, you can't do it. In fact, with the bionic hose, you can't kink it, you can't crush it, and you can't cut it. And I'm going to show you that. Now, watch this, because this is fun. I'm good for, like, you know, in an average season with a rubber hose, I'm good for, like, two or three, okay? okay? <laughs> and that's because, like, I'm constantly, like, dragging it across my pavement, or, or hitting it. crush this. The yep, end. crush the end. Yeah. Or I cut it like this, you know, when I'm using my hedge clippers or something like that. Now, I want you to just take a look there. Just made that cut very clearly. You can see that's ruined. Now, if I take the Bionic hose, put it in the same spot, same saw. Nothing. Nothing happening right there. I might, I, yeah, someone just said I, I sparks. Uh, we get sparks came out. I can start a fire before I'm actually gonna, you know, cut through, cut through the hose. But th that's the thing about this, and that's why these are gonna last you for years and years and years and years and years. Okay, so my first thought was, mm -hmm. wow, it's all metal. It's gonna be really crazy heavy. That actually was my first thought. Isn't that funny? Because I thought I hadn't touched it before, right? right. And I was like, man, this thing must weigh three thousand pounds because it's all metal. You would think. Right. But here's the thing. But it does and, 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 and here's the thing. Proof in the pudding, right here. Here. Here is 100 feet of a rubber hose, okay? Here's 100 feet of the bionic hose. The rubber hose weighs 14 pounds. The bionic hose is only eight. That's so it's six pounds different, which, and you know, you think six pounds, big deal. Well, think about lifting up a jug of milk and holding that in your hand for a long time. That gets heavy after a while. Well, with, you know, dragging uh, um, that extra six pounds across your backyard when you reel up the hose, sure. I mean, it'll knock you down. Plus, you can reel up the hose with this. Yes. And I'll tell you, the first and only time you see a hose look like this like is right when now. it's in its original package. That's right. Because <laughs> that never happens no. again, ever. No. <laughs> it's never going to look like that ever again. Now. What's interesting though is because it is lighter weight and it is so resilient, it also takes up a lot less space. That's great. Okay, so this is 100 feet of Bionic hose in an average size bucket. Okay, so wow. this is the kind of bucket you'd use to wash your car, you know, your boat or whatever, use this for that. But you can put 100 feet of hose in here. So think about the possibilities now. All of a sudden, if you live in an apartment or a condo, you don't have a garage, you have nowhere to keep a large length of hose, guess what? You do now. You could keep this in the trunk of your car. That's keep great. it on the boat. You'd have 100 feet of hose wherever you go. Right. And again, it's that lightweight. Like, I mean, it's yeah. crazy. It's super lightweight. You can take it around with you. It's not like you're dragging this all over the place. No. And we'll prove that. But I want to mention, too, we have all three sizes back in stock. Usually, we lose one or two sizes. So I was kind of thrilled to have that. And that's just for the holiday weekend. We have a 25 inch. We have the 75 inch. And we have the, or excuse me, the 25 feet, the 75 feet, and the 100 feet. The best value value is the longer size. So you're going to get your bigger bang for the buck when you go for the 100 feet. Also, just for the holiday weekend, we do have, in this case, four flex pays, but that's going to actually end tomorrow night. Yeah. Okay. Well, and it, now, let's take a look at the scenario we've got going on right here, because you were talking about how the, <laughs> the hose that we had wound up there will never look that way again. Okay. It's going to look like this, okay? Once you take it out, it starts to develop a mind of its own. So and this one is actually fairly pliable still, because it's still kind of new, but as they get older, they, they like to play less and, and less. it's so heavy. Well, here, just, just do this. Just try oh, that. it's just awkward. Try, the, try that. Just to see the difference. Even, like, right? You know. It's and that's 100 hell. feet of hose right there. Now, look at the Bionic hose, also 100 feet. Wow of hose. We could put another 100 feet on there if we wanted to. It's incredibly neat looking, but watch this. Look how easily Crazy. I could just spin that around. I mean, it weighs next to nothing on there. Now, let's say, though, that you live someplace where the Homers Association says, you know what? You can't have a hose reel. Even though these cost a lot of money, you can't have these out in front of your house. Okay. So what do you do? Because they're unsightly. Flower that. pot. That's 100 feet of hose in a okay. flower pot. That's awesome. So it just as an alternative, it's one thing you could do. Okay, I have a very special testimonial Ooh. that you don't know about. Ooh. Are you ready for this one? Okay. Daryl, my producer, this is how nerdy we are at this job. 
we sit around and Very we talk weird. about products. Like you would think, <laughs> we talk a lot about Lou, but that's oh. a whole different story. But no, seriously, we, we are so nerdy. We actually have full on conversations about the products we use because you know, we work here, we buy a lot of product, right? So Daryl said this, and I'm a quote, this is my producer. He said, it does everything we say it does. It doesn't get stuck in roots or on bushes. Yeah. And we have never talked about that before. And I thought he brought up a great point. So I literally wrote oh, yeah. his quote down. No, right? that, that's actually you know a really good point. Stuck on roots, like these will get caught yep. and then you're pulling It's the in. rubber, the rubber, you know, we wear rubber on the bottom of our shoes for a reason because it gives us traction. Oh, true. Okay. Right, right. So if you're dragging around something that's made of rubber, it's going to be getting stuck on things. Okay. The metal hose though, it's like quicksilver. When you take this out and you drag it across the concrete, it glides across there. My house where, where you know, where I live to get to the farthest end of my yard, I've got to take my hose from the side of my house, go through a, a, a metal fence, go across a paver patio around metal furniture. Oh, oh yeah. And I don't, yeah, I'm not gentle. I just drag it. And this is why I can do it because it is that it's a standard hose on the inside of sorts, but then it's got the steel, stainless steel windings on the outside. Right. And that's what makes it so strong. So now, you're not dragging the hose and all your furniture out to the yard with no, you at the same time. No, it just glides right, right across right, it. And right. then that's the beautiful and thing it about really it. It really does. I mean, I think that's what Daryl's point was. It just yeah. glides around everything very easily. Well, you know, sometimes Daryl doesn't have a point. Well, he did on this one. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, buddy. Okay. It was an alert moment for my producer, Daryl. <laughs> <laughs> so, now, here's the next thing I want to show you, though. Check this out, okay? Look at the bionic hose and look at all the knots. And if you go down the length of the hose here, there's a really <laughs> bad one here. There's a whole bunch of there's them. There's like eight or down. nine yeah. that I made in here, okay? And I can pull on this really hard, which is what I'm doing, and I can't stop the flow of water, okay? Take a look at the rubber hose that I've got next to us right here. And you can see the clearly there's knots in there, too. Look at the little sorry trickle of water. <laughs> that's coming out of the rubber hose and look at the stream full on that's coming out of the bionic hose. I mean, that is one of the amazing features of this is that you cannot stop that flow of water. It's not going to kink. Now, we were that what we were just talking about with the, um, you know, dragging it across the driveway and all that. Yeah. Take a look at this right here because we do have a length of hose sitting out here on the driveway, okay? And that's, I think this is a 25 foot length that we've got going down here. Now, watch how quickly and easily I can bring this hose in. You ready? Watch this. And the whole thing comes in. And you're not dragging the cat, the dog, the I'm bushes. not dragging, I'm not dragging anything. Not and that's dragging lawn chairs with you. Yeah, I mean, that's a great thing. And if I want to deploy the hose, yeah, look how easy that is for me to pull in. Now watch this. Okay. If I want to deploy it, I just throw the hose out like that. But watch this. This is the coolest thing. Look at how it glides across that paper. You can't do that with a rubber hose. No, no, okay? no way. You are never going to do that with a rubber hose. And when you're ready to pull it in, you just get in the slack, just give it a nice tug and the whole thing comes in again. By the way, we do have the uh, seven spray nozzle, so if you want to get the nozzle to yep. go with it, that is available. And again, what's really nice as well, let me give you an update. Dad, oh my gosh. We have now sold almost 17 thousand that's more than half of our quantity for the whole weekend gone and obviously it's wildly popular every time we have it on the air because you know what it's something we all need you know there's not a person in the world even if you live in an apartment or something like that you know we all you need something practical like a hose you'll never go to the green hoses again it's wildly durable it's very lightweight considering how durable it is that's kind of was my biggest surprise when i saw it and it's convenient you know and you don't have to worry about replacing your hose every single single season. How many of you, if you wrestle with a green hose, why would you do that when you have the perfect alternative in this? Yeah. And again, three links tonight. We have the uh, 25 inch, the 75 inch or er, foot and the 100 foot, right. 25 inches. I'm just going to water right here. <laughs> I was going to say, it's not a very long yard you have. It's no, not very big. <laughs> well, yeah, okay. So for at the end of the day, for me, you remember back when we used to sell the expandable uh, hoses yes. and everybody sold them and they were wonderful for their time and everybody loved them. The, I found a couple of flaws with them. The problems I had were twofold. One, dragging them around, they would wear out. Like you could get through, the, you cut through the fabric on those. And if you left them sitting in the sun, they would burst, mm, okay? Sure. I have left my hose sitting outside, my bionic hose sitting across my driveway for hours on a hot day in Florida. And it is never, it doesn't even get hot. Like you can walk up to it, pick it up, doesn't even get hot. Okay. No yeah, so it's not, definitely not gonna burst. That that is not going to be a problem with these hoses. To me, that's a big deal. But for the weight factor, that's totally. huge. You know, the fact that I can take, I mean, just look at the difference in size, okay? That's 100 feet on a best day. That's as good as this hose is ever going to look yep. of a rubber hose. And look at the bionic hose here. We, we This isn't exactly all wound up properly, but look how much smaller 
it is in size sure. and yet 100 feet 100 feet the difference is this one is six pounds lighter on the bionic hose that's great it's a big deal and i think sometimes too and i've said this in the past if something is difficult or bulky or awkward we consciously or subconsciously avoid doing it that's true so how many projects do you have around the house let's let's say hey you know what i really wish we would you know wash the windows okay mm -hmm. or, or these the vinyl looks like a hot mess and no one's willing to go out and do it it's because consciously or subconsciously this is a hassle and we don't <laughs> do it when it's easy all of a sudden those projects get done because you lose some of the stress of doing it no it's true and well, i think it, there is a psychology to that oh I, I believe it and i'll tell you and well it's the same reason why a lot of times people just leave their hoses out for days on end because right, it's right. just so heavy to drag them back in not the case with the well, bionic hose. What if you don't, you maybe you don't plant things. Maybe you don't have a garden because you simply don't want to drag a hose to water yeah. it. Maybe you want to get new sod, but you don't want to drag a hose out to have the sprinkler system work, you know? There's so many reasons to be able to get this, and it's nice to have it back in stock. But remember, the four flex pay is only good for today. Oh, yes, and always the 100-footer is the most popular. Yes. Of course, you get more bang for your buck on the 100-foot. And then, of course, we have the 25-foot and the 75-foot. Lou, we see you later on tomorrow? Oh, yeah. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, yeah. And I'll be back tomorrow night actually i got a couple hours i'll be wrapping up our big labor day finale so i expect it to be fireworks and a lot of fun thanks for hanging out a new today special starts right now It's a new day here at HSN. I'm Leslie. Welcome in. We have a deal for you. Say goodbye to the restless nights. HSN has partnered with the leaders when it comes to manufacturing of wonderful mattresses, helping us sleep better. Last mattress today's special of the year for Beauty Rest. We're going to save you close to $400. Here it is, our best value of the day. Well, you are looking at the iconic mattress from the iconic American brand, Beautyrest. They've been around for over